guys. Yeah, Rick and Jennifer fans already out here tailgating. They will be for the next couple hours. Of course, kickoff not until 8 o'clock tonight. St. X and Trinity, the biggest game of the year after a week of events at the schools. Pep rallies today, and now we're ready for some football, Dom. That's what it's all about. The coaches talked about how they love the fun, all the events that goes on, but it's all about winning the football game, and it's hard to believe this is the 91st meeting between these two state powers, St. X and Trinity, two teams hoping to compete for state championships at the end of the season, but the only trophy they're concerned about tonight is the shillelagh. Every year, it's a game that's the talk of the town. It's the community's game. I mean, it's the Catholic community's game. You've got a lot of things going on. You've got to block out the distractions, and you've got to concentrate. You've got to focus. Trinity and St. X are two experienced teams very familiar with this rivalry. The respect is mutual. Just excitement. Just you feel that blood pumping, and you're ready to go. The coaches uh, both know, know each other very well and know the game plans each other have, so we have to change stuff up a little bit. Trinity is searching for consistency. In last week's game against Mel, the Shamrocks scored 17 unanswered points in the fourth quarter, but fell short 37 to 20. We know we're capable of playing like that all four quarters, and we really need to show that. And it starts this week right here. In a game like this, it's really big, so we need to come out all four quarters hot and stay on it. The Tigers started the year 3-0 in a big victory over the Bulldogs, but suffered in the second half to lose by 10 to Elder, Ohio. A little bit of rat poison got in on us. Uh, after the mail game with people telling us how good we are and then we had a week off to absorb all that greatness that everybody was telling we were heading for and uh, the reality is that uh, we, we've got a lot of things to improve on if we want to be really really good a rivalry game at uofl's ellenin stadium is a perfect momentum boost for both teams our kids focus on big games uh, and our problem is we've got them every week so getting those kids up every week is a heck of a challenge. That's what it's all about, the excitement here. Thank you so much, cheerleaders. St. X Trinity game, it's always what it's all about. Another fun thing about tonight, St. X has won two straight heading into this contest. Yeah, and Trinity had won 17 of 19 before that. We'll hear more from both head coaches. We're talking about Trinity's freshman quarterback. We'll do that coming up at 6 o'clock in sports. But for now, live at LNN Stadium, doing a little tailgating. Let's go back to you guys.